Yo, what's up guys? So today I'm going to be giving you guys a gear review. So the gear that I choose is obviously a very personal decision, but I feel very strongly that everything I choose allows me to perform to the best of my abilities. So naturally when I'm like, oh my God, this kite is so sick. I just want to tell my friends about it. So that's what I'm doing right over here. I'm going to tell you the gear that I like. And I'm also going to tell you the things that I don't like about this gear. I'm going to try and keep these reviews as honest as possible and I hope that it can inform your buying decisions and help you shred and have a good time on the water just like I'm doing. Yeah. So for today, we've got the Core Union Comfort Straps. I've been riding these for about a year and a half now and I gotta say, I love these straps. I choose to ride them even though they're not the top of the range core straps. And I probably get less honeys because of it. I mean, I know you, you know the honeys are frothing when they see those $350 super fancy straps. But here I am with my basic ones and I love them. And I'm gonna tell you why. So I'm really into board offs. And what I really love about these straps is it's super quick and easy to open them up widen them because it's nice to have loose straps for board offs and then tighten them again which is it's pretty cool you literally just go boom open lift your foot and then close them and if you want to tighten them because you're in some strong conditions just lift the strap pull it down boom and now your straps are tight again the other things that i like are that they're super super soft there's a nice wide opening here so my foot can go in and out really easily like I say, soft, like comfy, super comfort. It says it in the name. And um, you got a really nice, cool toe ridge over here that allows you to grip the board super well. So, yeah, I'm really stoked about these. And the only downside of these straps versus the Carved Ultra or the Core Union Pro is that they, they're not as durable. After a couple of weeks, you'll notice that these little uh, diamonds start peeling off a bit. And it happens quite a bit at the start, and then they peel off at the back. But after that, once you've eaten through them quite a bit, the wear and tear tends to stop. The pads soften up even more, they get really comfortable. And my last pair, I just like, I rode them into the ground. And I gotta say, I enjoyed every single minute of riding those straps. So yeah, they're not as durable, they are more affordable, um, but they're definitely more comfortable and super easy to use. So that's like the go-to for me. So guys, if you want to purchase these straps or other Big Air gear, you can get them at BigAirKite.com. And when you shop on Big Air Kite, 5% of your order goes to the Big Air Kite League. That's the competition league that's been running worldwide in order to give young shredders or old shredders, just competitive big air riders, an opportunity to showcase their talents, push themselves, push one another, and make a career out of big air kiting. And also 5% of your order goes to a big air rider just like me. So your purchases are making things happen in the community and supporting the careers of professional kite surfers. So uh, thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you want me to review next on my channel and otherwise please do subscribe for more gear reviews how-to videos and uh just some videos of obviously me shredding you know you know how it is a little bit of a shred over here and there give it a like give me a comment muchos pesos i love you guys adios